What's going on guys, Brandon here coming at you another video today. Playing some Domination on the map Comeback, and I am the Comeback King. And I don't mean that by bringing the batch Mac, bringing the batch Mac. I just did Spoonerisms and I didn't even mean to. <laughs> bringing the match back, I mean I'm the king of the map Comeback. Not literally, but I did go off in both of these matches. It's two games back to back on comeback going off with the ASM1 man I cannot wait to get the speakeasy but just the other day I picked up the ASM1 reckless and I'm telling you right now that gun is the closest you can possibly get to the speakeasy it's got built-in rapid fire which gives it a plus one the speakeasy has plus two and it's got the built-in extended mag so what I did with this one is I threw a foregrip and um, advanced rifling on it I thought about throwing extended mag but you know you need that advanced rifling with um, this gun as well as if I had the speakeasy I haven't got to use it yet but I imagine it would be the best setup strictly because it's the best setup on this one I wish that you could run four attachments, that would be dope, because then I could have the extended mag, and it would basically be the speakeasy, just wouldn't look as cool. But honestly, statistically, the ASM-1 Reckless is better. Like, uh, the speakeasy fires a little bit faster, obviously it's got the built-in, you know, drum, so you get extended mag, uh, but other than that, this one statistically is better like it doesn't have as many negatives which uh, the speakeasy is a fucking god gun excuse my language but that gun is sick like my buddy's got it and um, you know I've picked it up several times and it's awesome it's a really solid gun but I am perfectly fine now that I got this reckless because honestly from a shooting standpoint like this gun reminds me exactly of the speakeasy like the only difference really is you don't have an extended mag which I could throw on it but like I said I would prefer to have the advanced rifling instead you know a 45 round clip is plenty and uh, you know you can always run scavenger if you're worried about running out of ammo but for now that's just how I'm gonna run it foregrip and advanced rifling so if you pick up the Reckless or you already have it, give that a shot if you don't already. Check this crap out. Kill this guy. This guy's staring at me the whole time. I started laughing my ass off at that part because I did not understand what he was doing. Like, why did he just sit there? He must have been MIA. Like, controller sat down, wasn't paying attention to the game, just figured he'd leave his body on B and, you know, hope for the best. Hope that his teammate would be able to save him, but... I thought that was hilarious like I was like what is this guy doing my buddy Josh was like what Zergen destroyed by the way go check out his channel there you go Josh another plug for you boy but uh yeah guys um I don't really have a whole lot to talk about in this one um I know what I can talk about I was gonna save it for another video but I decided that um you know I'm not going to do a commentary on my infected video just because there were some funny moments in there where you could hear me um, and I just think that it's whatever just leave it as is you know you can hear me in the background talking and uh, freaking out when I'm about to get slashed by one of the infected but um, I can't wait for exo zombies I don't know I'm sure you guys follow it just as much as I do but um, they came out with the trailer yesterday showing way more off and I imagine it'll probably be the yeah it definitely will be the last trailer that we'll get before the map pack comes out on the 27th but um it looks so sick like I am so stoked for zom exo zombies now because I was really hoping that they would do it a lot like Treyarch zombies because Treyarch zombies is the best like I love zombies and um, 
yeah, this looks like it's going to be just as fun, hopefully. I don't see why it wouldn't be, to be perfectly honest, because literally it reminds me of Treyarch Zombies with Sledgehammer's own twist on it, you know. Obviously the zombies have exos, so they're going to be moving way faster, and uh, it's going to be really creepy, and they got the mystery box back, um, it looks like Pack-a-Punch is back, they got perks back, they got everything back, man, like, not back, I guess that's the wrong way to word it, but they have it, just like Shared Zombies, so it's going to be a lot of fun, I know it is, like, you'll be seeing a lot of exo zombies yep. on my channel so hopefully you'll enjoy that once it comes out um hopefully you guys enjoyed this video we're coming up to the end to it so i'm just gonna cut it off here obviously because i have to <laughs> leave a like guys if you enjoyed subscribe if you're new and as always i'll see you in the next one peace